I was nicknamed the news raider. It just basically, I appeared on just on every live news broadcast. So every time a reporter had something to report, there I was in the background, just standing there. I think I made possibly over a hundred broadcasts. Um, it all started when I was campaigning. I attended a lot of protests at the time. And I would notice that the reporters would always, you know, avoid talking to me in particular. What I would see is that the microphone was always passed when I was standing there to somebody who looked obviously a lot more pleasant than I did. The reporters would avoid talking to me. I think it's because I'm overweight. I am heading for middle age. So it was a protest really. Well, it was the Russell Howard show that started it. Uh, there were so many viewers on that program and he kept showing me on this program. He started the introduction as saying that there is this one fat guy who wants to be on television. And people then assumed that it was a comedic thing because the way I looked, oh, it's, people assume that overweight people are quite funny. I just don't feel that way, actually, inside. It was frightening. That 15 minutes of fame took approximately two days, and uh, it was suddenly, from just doing a quiet shopping, go, go, going off to the shops quietly, suddenly people would just come up to you and ha take a selfie, or, and I felt very a bit intimidated, the sudden attention to, to me. I'm grateful that it's sort of fizzled out now. I'm hoping that the message did something at that time. People were actually um, writing in support of what I was trying to say, you know. Being known as the Reagan News Raider hasn't really, hasn't really brought anything for me, but I'm hoping that, that at least I brought a message across, across the world, really, to be honest with you just basically treats everybody as equal, really. Click the videos to watch more Londoners and don't forget to subscribe.